I go to the bathroom, I come back, and you have a lamp in your cart. Would you like to explain yourself? Oh, yes. My family calls it my superpower. It's my ability to see value in things that other people might overlook. Sometimes I go picking with my boyfriend, sometimes it's my best friend Sue, and sometimes it's my kids. But at the end of the day, it's all about having fun and hopefully just maybe making a profit. Okay. Hey. Well, we just finished our lunch ordeal. We, and it ordeal. was an ordeal this time. It was a time. lunch ordeal. The lunch ordeal. And now we're going to community aid. We're going to see what we can find here. And the last two or three times we've done pretty well here. We've done very well so, here, so we're pretty excited. Yeah, we're looking forward to goodies today. The goodies. All right. So we're gonna head in and see what we can find for resale and we will catch you in see a bit. See you in a sec. Bye. All right, now let's take a look at the outcome. Flashy we'll sign. What did you find? I found a baby carriage. I see that. Too bad you're not having babies anymore. <laughs> No, thank you. <laughs> what do you think of the teddy bear, Sue? Oh, he's cute, but I don't think he's cute enough to come home with me. No. A lot of lamp. Well, there's another teddy bear lamp. Then you don't usually have good lamps here. Very rarely. No good lamps. Okay, so I think it's become like a weekly ritual where we get here and I have to go straight to the bathroom because I have to pee after lunch. But now, we're stuck with the figurines. And um, going through the figurines and not being able to leave them here. Like these guys right here, check this out. Those are really cute. I will probably leave them here though because they're not really my style of figurines. We've got this guy here. I saw him last week when I was editing my video. I didn't actually see him while I was standing here filming the video. But now that I'm seeing him up close, New Orleans, um, he's not really something I would typically grab. He's not as good quality. Even some of the stuff that I'm picking up that is Japan is better quality than this. And you can see there, on the rose, he's got a broken uh, petal, so I'm gonna leave that there. I've got all these Boyd's bears. I'm pretty sure that's what these are. Yes, they are. <laughs> we are in Boyd's bear country, so we come across a lot of these. I don't think they're worth very much money. I've never, I'd never look at them. I've got a blind eye for those. And you've got this terrifying thing. But no, I'm not really seeing a whole lot in figurine land. Yeah. This gold swan, eh. Nothing really. This is cute. Carved skunk. No, let's go find Sue. I go to the bathroom, I come back, and you have a lamp in your cart. Would you like to explain yourself? Oh, yes. Here. <laughs> just explain myself. <laughs> I know, you're thinking to yourself, oh my god, you can't be serious about that lamp. No one can. Oh, oh, your lamp. Oh, it almost broke your dish. Okay. I'm not serious about that. Oh, look at that very I'm bizarre very harp. serious about the shade. That's a bizarre harp. I don't think I've ever seen that before. This is a very high quality shade. I mean, look at this. It's nice. Solid, yeah. I'll find a use for this. Oh, I don't doubt that for a second. Look at that delightful harp. I've never seen one like that. That's like a rectangular harp. That's now bizarre and unique. I'm just gonna leave it like this. I like explain it. Explain when I get to the checkout. <laughs> yes, this was oh gosh. Check it apart. Okay, I'm gonna go back and start at the beginning because obviously I'm like behind on this one because I'm always running to the bathroom as soon as we get here. I always have to pee. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm broken. Hold that thought. I'm going to start at the beginning. Of course, we're going to skip the lamps because there's never anything good in the lamps. Okay, um, let's see here. Oh, what do we have here? 
See, I like this because I'm from New England. Sue likes this. Sue, oh yes. Because she's from New England, and she this loves is Sue like. Dolls, yes. What, what's the marking on the bottom? There isn't. Is it? It's just a. Oh, a, okay, that's right. That's not. It's right. a one dollar. That's what that is, and then. That's cute. Community marked it up too. I would drink my coffee out of this though. If this doesn't sell, this is my coffee mug. Look at this. I this like it. Um, What's it marked? Yes. Um, Winterling, Germany, Royal Heidelberg. Ooh, Winterling. Nice I've come across that a few blue. times. It's pretty. It looks hand. No, it looks transfer. Is it? Yes. But it's still nice. Yeah. Um, yeah, it feels like transfer wear. It is still I nice, think though. It's pretty. Yes. I like the blue. The blue is nice. The gold $4. is nice. For $4, I'd say yes. I saw the yes to this. Yes. That um, you know my fondness for Korean. Yes. Porcelain. I don't I come across it. it very often, but when I do. Chip. Of course. But it's got that same speckled character that a lot of my favorite Korean porcelains have. So believe me, if this did not have a chip, it would be in my cart right now. Let's see here. We've got little runner dudes. We've got this guy. Food Network. I just can't get behind that. I'm sorry. Um, I'm not really seeing. Somebody is playing a beautiful melody for us. It's this child, I think. It's this child down here. He's playing a beautiful melody. Serenading us, even. Oh my gosh, is you're going to kill me for not getting these for him? Oh my god. Would he even use them? He doesn't drink. But these are wonderful. Sue? Yes. So my debate is whether or not to get these for Andrew, because he does not drink. But they are bicentennial. They've got the Liberty Bell on them. Oh, I would. You tell would? Him tell him it's an orange juice glass. He would drink orange juice out of these. He would. So okay. just say, look, this is an orange juice. <laughs> okay, I will. For a dollar each. And if he doesn't want them, we'll list them on eBay for you guys. But um, I think that's something he would like. And I feel like if I don't buy them, he's going to be like, why didn't you buy those? And now if I do buy them, he's going to be like, why did you buy those? So I'll tell, I'll tell him it was Sue's idea. <laughs> oh, gosh. Fierce friend. Oh, Sue, I would give this to you. What does that say? You are my fierce friend. Oh. I could drink your Starbucks out of it. When it rains, you see rainbows. When it's dark, you see stars. That's you, not me. <laughs> oh, I love it. All right, this guy is still here, but he's still cracked. A lot of you asked me why I didn't pick this up for the Bassett Rescue. And the reason being, it is still cracked. Oh. They were asking me why I didn't pick this up for the Bassett Rescue, but it's cracked, yeah. unfortunately. Oh look, McCoy, USA. I don't know if that's actual McCoy, or if it's like, I want to be McCoy. Or that it's something somebody made, and their name happened. <laughs> oh, those are cute. They're I've nice. seen those before. Yep, because this is not one of a kind pieces. Um, it's made in Japan. Ah. Somebody offloaded a huge amount of Japanese porcelain in here recently. They have, um, yeah. Here. Right up. Is that Noritake? Yeah, it is. It's nice though. Yes, it is, but it's part of a whole dinner set. Here's the rest of it. I'm sure it's here somewhere. I may end up picking up a few of the pieces that I think will sell independently, mm -hmm. this being yeah. one, because it's a cake plate. It's cute. I was surprised you didn't pick it up, honestly. I it's didn't nice. see it. I, I was looking at the pieces over here. Oh, I know. I always miss the stuff on the bottom, and then I come back through and look at the bottom. <laughs> but they've got... They've, yeah, what about these over here? Platters. Did you look at these? Uh, those are both German, I believe. Are they? And, um, yep, MNZ Austria. I've got is, a piece listed on eBay right now by MNZ. This is all Noritake here from the same pattern. It's very pretty though. It is. Um, I'm taking the cake plate because I believe the cake plate will sell. I should probably take this piece too. 
that will probably sell it's, nicely. Yeah, it's a nice dish. Nice serving but dish. For the rest of them, no. Um, it's just really hard to offload these big pieces. I know a lot of people a lot of people are like, oh, you missed that full scrap. Fold scrap is one of those things that is very, very hard to sell. And they're like, oh, I'm missing that piece in my fold scrap collection. It, you know, there's one person online who's missing that one piece in their fold scrap collection that I can sell it to them for three dollars. Right. But fold scrap for resale is a pit. <laughs> this is really this, on the other hand, talky. It is and a small piece like this. I'm paying two dollars. I can unload this. At a relatively good price because, because it's, it's beautiful. Only two it is. You look at that border. It's lovely. If my camera will focus on it, it's it's really nice. Um, the same thing with the cake plate, mm -hmm. which is the same pattern. Yeah. Here is another piece. Oh, I like that. That is another piece. Is this Noritake? Yes. That's another piece of Noritake. That is just. That's. I love the gold. It's got a little boo-boo. It does. Oh, nope, no, it's it just isn't. a okay. little it's dirt. Schmutz. It has, oh my god, it had It's dirt. a little schmutz. A little schmutz. <laughs> How nice. <laughs> Alright. This is a really, really sweet piece. Um, that sure, that'll sell. It's beautiful. Um, I like it. And as I keep saying, this is the time to grab the Nippon because right now it's depressed. It will bounce back. It always does. Absolutely. So let's so, look for it. <laughs> take a look at what else we have. Old cars. Souvenir plates. Well, Man making crib. And I've been going through this because like I say, someone, white and mamey, oh my word. <laughs> that makes me feel really old. Oh goodness. What about that one in the back? Oh, that's wine. Well, the yeah, one back there is probably Italy. Damn. Lots of wine. Heavy. Hmm. Fault scrap. We were Maybe just talking time. about yes, that. We Throw it back. Throw it back. Throw it back. Um, but like I say, somebody offloaded a huge set of Asian porcelain. And. I keep looking around for whatever else might have been offloaded. Oh, yeah. Shipment. That's like Drew and I yesterday at the bins with that African stuff. Yep, what else looking. is in here? <laughs> this is another piece. It's not very expensive. Aruba. Same thing. This is, um, this is a Japanese piece. But it's like those other couple of plates I grabbed. Um, the reason I'm not grabbing this is... Aruba, it's a tourist piece. Mm -hmm. So I don't think that's going to sell, even though it's very pretty. I need somebody who adores Aruba. I don't know where you find it. I've never been there personally. I have. But I'm sure if I have, I, I would like Aruba's it. Aruba's the one with the square coins. Oh. Yeah. Just, square coins. Square coins. Oh. So we've got some etched glass here. You know, all this clear glass doesn't really sell for a whole lot. So we usually skip past this. We just see something like this might sell the sugar and cream. It might, set, but it's not going to sell no, for very much. No. You know, three dollars for this, three dollars for this. You've already got six dollars in for it. It's probably going to sell for ten to twelve. Exactly. So once it's, you get into fees and all of that, you're not making enough not money. It's not worth your time. So we usually skip over that. Same with milk glass. You guys know, unless there's a very unique piece, I will skip over it. Well, this down here is pretty. That's pretty. That is pretty. That's one of those handmade pieces. It is one of those handmade pieces. I've made one of these before. You know they use lace doilies and they press them into the clay. Oh my word, is that that's not That's what clever. it is, yep. Yeah. And then it's marked with the signature of the maker, but that's what this is. This is a lace doily pressed into the clay and cool. then the clay is crimped. That, that is so cool. Isn't that neat? Yeah, it is. Um. What is this? Chip. This is and see, this is what I like about community aid is they, they tell you this is chipped. So if you do buy it for $6, there was a chip on the inside. So you are aware. It's a Japanese piece. Look, it's got the little drippy here. Yep. Little drippy. 
and it looks like it's got a crack all the way down. Oh, and it certainly does. Plus, it's got more damage right across here. Unfortunately, it is nice. Oh, I like that matte piece. Oh, what is that? Oh, look at that. False crap. Okay. What is happening today? Is it just because yeah, I was no, trash yeah, talking yeah, false no, crap that the world, the universe yeah, is out no, to I, get me? I, the universe is like, you're gonna trash talk us. We're gonna yes. get you. But look down here at this open lace bowl Whoa, that I just found okay, for six dollars. <laughs> that is beauty. so. Whatever false crap. Look what I just found. Open lace. And I'm gonna hold it carefully so I don't end up dropping. Mm, that's something I, I would do. Find anything broken. It's beautiful. It's six dollars. I could probably expect to make twenty to twenty-five for oh, yeah. it. So it's not a huge turnaround. But it's beautiful. It's but it's beautiful. beautiful. It Normally really I find is. them in milk glass, but this is the open lace that we talk about. Interesting. Yeah. I'm not quite sure that's Japanese too. Um, what about that instant coffee back there? Ooh. I like him. Japan. He's missing his little stirrer. He would have had a little spoon. Oh, the spoon would have gone into the yeah, hole. Yeah, and you could like scoop your sugar into it. It's actually quite cute. It is. It's not very old. It's got the sticker. Nobler Japan. It's nice though. I like this. I'm gonna take that with me. You could put a little spoon through there. I like yeah. that. That looks Italian. If you're gonna grab that one, I'm gonna, oh, $10. Nope, you don't. Where? Where? Oh, I see, I see, I see, right here. Nope. Oh, there's another broken spot? Right here. Oh, Bad. here so and here. So this one is teensy weensy. Ooh, like we should probably is. tell them. I don't think they know that. They've got it listed for 10 bucks. I'm gonna put this in my cart. I'm gonna bring okay. it up front. Because here at Community Gate, they're honest, and if they had noticed that, they probably wouldn't have it listed for 10. Oh, our pudding dish is still here. We've got a little bank, but We've got cookies up here. We've got a nice picture. This is a fun piece. This is modern though. You can actually see the residue from the sticker on there that says, hey, I'm modern guys, don't grab me. Got little geeseys. Got a swan down there. A beautiful butterfly. Blackberry wine. Oh my gosh. Is this a decanter? It is a decanter. This is for wines. Oh. You're kidding me. I would drink my wine out of this. Oh my god. <laughs> that's, that's amazing. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. Hold on here. What do Ooh, we have? What did you find? I found something. A little monk. It's cute. Oh, you know I gotta send that home for Andrew. <laughs> you know I do. I like this. Oh look, big lots. Say we do get fooled from time to time. That's why we have stickers on the bottom of stuff. Hey! <laughs> He'll like that. I will send that home. So this right here looks like bush pottery. It's not marked, but that's like, you know, that's that swirly, like, glazy stuff. That's like bush pottery. It's $3. We're going to put that in the cart. But then what really caught my eye over here before I grabbed that even was this ceramic piece. I like that. I mean, it kind of looks like in poly shape. It kind of looks like an apothecary jar. It's marked Kitty. Kitty made this. Oh. This was made by Kitty. It's marked Kitty. That is nice, though. <laughs> you know, I like those hand pieces. I, I know, really I know. Kitty, I think we're going to take your piece home with us. Because your name's Kitty, mostly. There we go. Uh, I would hoard it. Yeah, you hear that? Sue would hoard it. I'm gonna hoard this piece, but it is a really nice piece with really nice lines. And this piece is going to me. It's not marked anywhere. It doesn't have any marker on it. But it's like heavy, heavy stoneware pottery. Six dollars. I'm probably gonna use it for a bowl inside of my door. I do that a lot. I'm like a real proponent for inside your door bowls where you can throw your keys. I like that. This is what it's gonna do. You agree, Ray Sue? I do. <laughs> um, I just grabbed a piece over there that is um, a nice place, possibly Raku. I like it. Um, oh, hello. Oh, whoa, interesting. Yes, I have one of these. Reed and Barton, the world's silver plate. I have these. You guys know I have these. I actually gave one of these to Bird. <laughs> he loved it. 
I have the I have the larger version of this exact same bowl. And Bird likes to look at his reflection in this bowl. I gave it to him. He sits on the top and he looks down in it and he sees his reflection. So obviously it needs polished. Dang little beast. Yeah, Sue watched Bird while we were in Canada, didn't you? He was very good. He didn't bite me. He didn't bite you. Well, you know, those bird little beaks, they're very vicious. You have to watch out for them. Well, actually, it's more than just he didn't bite me. He came to me when when I, I let him fly around. He, <laughs> I, I, I thought he was going to run away and just say, get away from me, woman, I don't know you. He's such a good bird. This is a piece for Sue. I found this for you. Oh, well, he's a Italian, you're a tacky. It's not chipped, is it? Mm -hmm. It's a little mm. tiny bit along the bottom. Well, that's consistent with age. It is. That's what I put in my listings. If it's consistent with age, if it's like a it nasty is. chip, I'll say it is chipped. But this is a Noritake because Noritake was one of the better porcelain factories in Japan. And uh, when you see Nippon pieces, you, uh, you can usually spot Norta, mm -hmm. which is why when you walked over with that, it was a <laughs> nice little piece. But it's knows, cute. That may not go for sale. It might not. She might hoard it. Who yeah. knows? All right, we're back into the figurines. We've already Thank looked you. through here. You're welcome. You're very welcome. Um, I don't really see a whole lot. You guys know we kind of already glazed through these, but... I mean, we've got some coil baskets down there, but those are just modern coil baskets. Oh my word, the bear with the sunglasses and the parasol is a little too much. You know that's just for us, right? <laughs> she did that for us. I'm sure she did. She did. She did. She wanted us to see it. Yes. She loves us. <laughs> All right. Ooh, this reminds me of something that Real Nifty Vintage picked up recently. His was all hand-painted, though. This is just boring. Yeah, he picked up one with all hand painted little, um, those little bells, those flower bells on okay. it, and it had like really nice painting. And cool. my, this one's just boring. <laughs> he finds better stuff than I do. Darn it. <laughs> I'm not really seeing anything else. Oh, and now we're down to the plastic stuff. And this is where we usually turn and pivot. It just occurs to me that by the time you guys are seeing this video, Right now, I am in Syracuse, New York, visiting my grandparents, and my grandma loves birds. Oh. And I'm thinking I'm gonna bring this to Syracuse for her. So I am gonna take this with me, and I've been looking at that. I know everyone watching my video is like, what about that, what about that, what about that? I am looking at that. I am looking at it, gosh darn it. That seems to be a napkin holder or something. I'll just grab it because I know everybody in my video is going to be like, you didn't grab that. You didn't grab that. You didn't grab that. I'm grabbing it. Look, this is me grabbing it. You know you saw it and you were like, why isn't she grabbing that? This is me grabbing it. This is me grabbing this and putting it in my cart. Ta-da. Now it does have a little itty bitty, itty bitty, itty bitty chip right there. But we're grabbing it. Because <laughs> I walked by it a couple of times and thought, why aren't I grabbing that? And I know all of you are thinking the same thing. We're going to grab this too. There's no critters here today. There will be one. I, I'm leaving without, cr I'm critterless today. Critterless. Unless I want a Boyd's bear, which I don't. Okay, well I've got my cart pretty much full. We're about to head into the checkout, but I figured I'd give you a close peek at what I've got in my cart. We've got our bowls, our little napkin holder goodies down in here we've got a couple things so she's got a lamp she's got all of her noritake stuff she's got some good stuff over there oh yes the shade is what i want that lamp for however that lamp because it is definitely a throwaway piece mm -hmm. might become a project yes we might actually and there's parts we can, there well i'm thinking we might see if there's something we can do to make it a little less throwaway absolutely all right but um i think we're getting ready to head out of here right oh yeah Anything you see that's good? No, I just, well, everything in your cart I'm happy with. <laughs> yeah, it's it's always a good thing. When we yes. leave and we're all happy with everything in my cart. Whereas other days, it's like, Jocelyn, I don't know about that. I don't know about that either, Sue. I think maybe I'm um, going to be a strikeout on that one. But I like it. <laughs> now we're going to go check out this table over here. Sometimes there's good yes. stuff. We'll get back to you up there, Riz. 
Looks like we've got some Wii gaming consoles, two of them. What do you suppose that is? That is a wax warmer. Oh my word. It makes your house smell good. <laughs> and a fancy clock. And, and lots of little wooden things. I think these things can be worth some money, but I don't know anything about these, so I'm not gonna get any of those. This is kind of fun. Now this is marked $50. I'm sure it's worth that. But I don't even use a house phone anymore. I wouldn't even know anything about that. But that is fun. This is the kind of stuff you can find here. <laughs> this is fun too. $40 for this. Uh, I, I don't even know what that is. But it looks like fun. So on that note, I think we're going to get out of here. Okay, well we are actually going to be splitting this video into a two-parter. So we are back at our car. We are heading over to the Goodwill, but you will have to wait until tomorrow for that video. But okay. Yeah, well, we got a lot of nice we stuff today. We got really yes, well. I, I was so. pretty pleased with our stop at yeah. Community Aid today. But now we're heading over to the Goodwill. So that will be our next video yes. for tomorrow. And um, we we'll will see you, see you guys in a bit. Later. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and if you've spotted something that you just can't live without, don't worry. I've put a link to our Etsy store down in the description.